Welcome back to the channel, mates, mates. Today's video, we're going to be listing and ranking everything. No, seriously, everything. Neil.fun is a fantastic website you can go to for a bunch of cool stuff that's gone viral over the years, such as the most recent one, Infinite Craft. Uh, you know, the password game also had a break hold over the internet. But today we're doing Earth reviews, where basically if aliens came to Earth, what would be the feedback for these products? You know, things like bees, yawning, brunch, etc. So I have simply taken the everything reviews and put it into the tier list. And that is what we'll be doing today. If you like this video, make sure to like, comment and subscribe and let me know which one is your favorite in the comments. Here we go. So straight up, I think we're going to be doing in alphabetical order as that's what it seems to have done. Acne. I think this is a pretty uh, straightforward one. It's an S. Huh? You know, acne is fantastic. It lets you know the hormones are flowing. Just kidding. It's an F. I think that's pretty easy. Oh, well, actually, if F is the worst ever, then let's go E. And with that said, let's quickly go through what each rank means. So S rank obviously is the S tier, the supreme, the superior, the best. A means awesome and it is second. B is good. Uh, like good, but with a B. C is like mid, like ke, ke, like meh. D is for ding along, ding a sing song, which is, yep, lower than mid. E is like eh, eh. So it's like two minus Bs, and that's why it's down here. That doesn't make sense, but moving on. And then lastly is F, which is obviously for boo, like boo, but with an F, and is a fail. Therefore, it is the worst. So that's how we're ranking. Acne is an E, as you can see. Let's keep going. Airplanes, I think we're going to go C tier. I think airplanes are, or aeroplane, if you're a normal functioning adult, which I'm not, so it's airplane. Uh, airplanes carry a lot of sickness. They get you from A to B, though. I hate them. I I'm, have a fear of height, so maybe I'm biased. But yeah, C. They do the job, they're mid, moving on. Ants. Ooh, ants, they can bite you. Because that's how you get ants. They can bite you deep. I don't think they serve much purpose. I wouldn't care if they were all gone, uh, even if that meant the whole world collapsing. I think that's more than fair. Um, and so we are going to put ants in it. D tier. Apartments can be good, but overall, uh, I've never lived in one. I'm kind of biased. I'd say B, they're good for... Having a lot of people in, you know, city, but they're not great because they're a bit small and cramped, but they do free up a lot of urban space for parks and, you know, free space. Babies. F. Don't have them. Don't make them. Let's end this. Just kidding. Babies are B tier. You know, they got some problems. They scream and poop and yelling machines. Uh, they can't tell you what they want or need or think. Or feel, huh? uh, but they do create the next generation of humans or whatever. So, you know, they're a B tier. Banks, E tier. Uh, as they currently are, banks are monotonous, evil, capitalizing monstrosities that take advantage of millions of people. Uh, small banks can be all right, but overall, 90% of banks are basically thieves and they run the world. Um, yeah, to have some, something like a central bank behind every country uh, just doesn't fit right with me. We need to figure out a better way. I don't know what that is. Maybe you do. Comment your conspiracies down below. But yes. Yeah. Barbershops. A. Our first A. Barbershops are great. They, you know, give us these beautiful, beautiful manes, our luscious locks. It's nice that there's a male space, um, you know, and females have hairdressers mostly. And spent six hundred and eighty-five thousand uh, dollars for three centimeter cut and trim, but yes, barber shops are great. You know, have a beer, chat with a bro, you know, have a conversation that you might need to have about your mental health, whatever. That seems to be up and coming in barber shops. It's fantastic. So for that reason, barber shops go in A. Next, basketball. Eh, haven't played it. Don't really care for it too much. In my opinion, D. But for others, probably closer to S, A. I don't know. That's a tricky one. You have to love the sport. Beaches. Might be our first S tier. A natural phenomenon. I live in a country with, I think, the longest coastline in the world. Continuous for a country. 
uh, and a continent. No, not continent, just country. Uh, Australia, amazing beaches. I don't use them nearly as enough as I should. They're amazing. You know, great, great thing. Beards. Beard. Um, probably beard tier. I can barely grow one, as you can see from this beautiful baby face. Um, but for people who do, some guys look good with them. Some look terrible. Overall, not terrible to have. Not amazing. B tier. Bears. Ooh, bears. Forest puppies. Aww. I think C tier. They can be so harmful. They're beautiful, beautiful bears. Brother bear. But yeah, C because they can maul and attack and blah, blah, blah. But hibernation is cool though. So they've got that on their side and I wish I could do the same as the forest puppies. But alas. Bees. S tier. Hey, we need them. They keep us alive. Literally, without bees, we would all die. Go watch the bee movie. You like jazz? Shout out. Uh, not S tier because they can sting, and some people, actually, a lot of people can die from them in like one tiny little sting, which is a crazy thing. You know, just stop that genetically. Just stop it. You're weak. Stop. Um, but yeah, they are amazing. They're cute. They're little. Bzz, bzz, bzz. So, yes. Bicycles. I'm going to say. For the actual bike. Uh, a, but the riders make it a C. Yes, we go B for bikes. They're pretty great. They're, they're, you know, they burn fuel, make your legs thick as tree trunks. Uh, but the actual bike riders on the roads are cancer on society. Yeah, sorry about that. So I'd actually go A, but because of the riders, they're bumped down to B. Billboards. D. Some can be funny, most aren't. Most are cringe and capitalism. And it's basically the first, you know, I can buy things in your eye view. Oh. Now think about the future when that's the entire world is plastered on these and they're personalized for you individually so you're seeing them everywhere and you can't look away. Oh. Oh. I think advertising in general is a scam and scummy uh, and quite evil actually. But it's where we're living. So you gotta live with it. They are a D. Blinking is godlike, A. Hey, feels great. Oh, huh? boom. It's like a snapshot of a lens of a camera, you know? You're, you're re, re-juicing the lens. You gotta juice up. Hey, yo, what the fuck? B tier for blinking. Bones, pretty great. I'd say A tier as well. Pretty strong, pretty sturdy, calcified, calcified, and just fantastic, you know? Strong. Huh. Bones. Books. Oh, S tier. <laughs> Books are amazing. One of the first human feats of the mind to accomplish. How can we extract the value from our thoughts and share it with other like-minded creatures? Uh, right now, that's only Homo sapiens. Maybe in the future, who knows? Maybe the dolphins come up. So long, and thanks for all the fish. Okay, boulders. Rock! I mean, I like that boulder. That's a nice boulder, but C tier because they just they just exist. I mean, it's not a mountain. Uh, you know, it's just a boulder. Like a large rock you know see bowling bowling is pretty fine I think it's a b tier it's not the best game ever invented great for mates great for families many an argument hath happened about whether scores count from bumper bowls <laughs> uh but yeah bowling's b braces lisa needs braces shit c tier because of what they represent braces as a medicine you know, an adv a technological advancement, amazing, S tier. However, wearing them, the longevity of them, the look of them, all of that brings it down immensely to a C tier. I'm so sorry if you ever needed them. Uh, I never did, luckily, but yes, braces. Brunch? What about second breakfast? Brunch, eh, kind of overrated, but it's still pretty good. I'd say B, I love that it fills in the gap between breakfast and lunch, makes that cheaper save a whole meal if you can you know time it right you know you eat 11 ish uh and you just ho ho hope you don't go hypoglycemic in the morning but if you can fast till brunch and then you eat a nice big brunch mm, delicious calendars i mean seated they have some cute pictures on them sometimes they're overpriced though but as a concept i mean they're pretty good maybe even b tier for concept yeah, B tier for calendars. Campfires are A tier. They're not S because they're messy and require, you know, put up and clean down and stuff like that. Uh, but 
they're still pretty great and the, the memories and the again the concept of campfires is fantastic the physicality is fine too and the warmth they give canned food is a d tier it doesn't really matter which one it's kind of shit <laughs> to eat but uh it does the job and it's important if you're ever in a zombie apocalypse like all these bunker people you know apocalypse livers whatever they're called um yeah it's, it's below mid but it does the job carpet i love carpet this may mean i'm probably not. i prefer carpet to the now trend of like hard floors which are like fake wood but it's crap like vinyl but hard it sucks uh carpet is st uh is a tier it's not s tier because of the stains and the impressions and blah 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 but you can just replace it you know i love a good like soft white woolly carpet like to lie on amazing a tier cars i'm gonna say same as bicycles any transportation is probably gonna be b cars as a concept eh, maybe a they're pretty great but they're also very bad for the environment so we're staying b if we can figure out a way to make cars widely available and accepted and clean for everyone in the world we'll lock it in cats meow. a tier Meow. Am I right, fellow felines? Meow. Don't know what that means. Caves. Caves are pretty cool. B tier. Don't know much to say about them except cave divers need to stop. And they're like smushed up. They're like, I have to deflate my oxygen for the next hour and a half. Bear with me. And then they like crawl to their death through the uterine cave lining. Terrible. Chocolate is S tier. No real downsides. Delicious. You can get sugar-free or dark chocolate. Makes you feel good. Uh, S tier. Easy. Clouds are also... Eh, clouds, probably A tier. Haven't got much... I mean, rain clouds, though. They're pretty amazing, but that's it's not rain clouds. It's just clouds. They make shapes you want to see. They're perfect. It's a great psychological concept. We can visualize and imprint symbols in nothing, really. Speaks to the great creativity of human beings. And also, they're just badass clouds you know flying through them is sick coffee is easily s tier easy s tier coffee is amazing does have some withdrawal downsides maybe it does have to go a for the withdrawal stuff uh yeah it does coffee i love you but you, the withdrawals aren't great most consumed drug on the planet for a reason though and i do love coffee but it does have one drawback which is withdrawals uh they are brutal the migraines, etc. Coins are E tier. I don't know why they exist anymore. We need fiat currencies and stuff, but coins themselves are just stupid. Notes are much better. I mean, not much better. They're only a D tier, one tier above. But coins suck. We don't need them. Banks made them. You know, ew, banks, stinky banks. Ew. So yeah, college is literally smack bang in the middle. University for my fellow Aussies, uh, Kiwis, and Brits. University or college. The experience is important for people. This is this is important to understand. The concept of college is to grow up. That's in two words, grow up. It's the thesis statement of college itself. The the cost brings it down from, you know, S to A. The the bullshit that goes on there from A to B. The regrets and the you know bad choices and the not living other life or having a job and the cost of living etc brings it down to c but the benefits are you know human connection you should be forced to live on campus i firmly believe this but it should be subsidized and basically free and you need to experience a mini society while you're at college that's the point of it should be the point of it sorry um and it's disgusting that current politicians who had it for free now charge exorbitant rates professors don't even make that much the colleges accept international students by the bucket load pretty much worldwide in the western world and basically are cheating the system by just churning out students who don't even know what they're really doing or degrees and can't speak english um because they're not taught it it's not their fault but yes college itself the concept is great but brought down by the societal implications we put on it not necessarily it itself Hope that makes sense let me know in the comments what you think about college or university uh, i do think it's important for most people to go but the debt itself right now it's not worth it that's what i would say hopefully in the future consciousness holy moly i mean can there be anything more middling than consciousness 
the fact that we get to experience it, and eh, maybe a B. It's amazing to experience, but it brings with it a whole host of, pro well, every problem, because we can think about said problems. It's very meta in that it sucks because it exists, but it's great because we wouldn't know otherwise without it, you know? You ever thought you see a, a forest puppy or a normal pup or even a cat, and you're just like, they're just living in the moment. That's, you know, amazing. Well, they also can't know that they're in the moment or what's future or past. So consciousness, it's pretty great. Has some drawbacks. You know, we don't have a choice though. So it is what it is. Cooking, Let him cook. I don't like it, but I see why it's benefit. And if I don't have to do it, it's A. <laughs> uh, but for me, it would be a C, the actual cooking experience itself. I don't like it personally, but I get it. We need it. It's A tier. Crowds are fucking terrible. <laughs> Definitely an E. They're not as bad as banks though. But crowds suck for most things. Um, you know what? It is a D. It's not, not the worst thing in the world, but still pretty bad. You know, crowd crushing is fucking terrifying. New phobia of mine. Crowds just, eh. I'd rather not have them. I'd rather like a small group. You know, group. Give me groups. Where's groups? Groups ain't on here. Groups are great, crowds are not. That's my personal take. Crying is, man, C tier because you look ugly after it and during, but it's very cathartic, so it's not a D or E. It's cathartic, criminal. That doesn't make sense. Cathartic, but it sucks in the physicality of it and the red eyes and ugh, yucky. Dancing is pretty fun. B, don't have much to say about it. I'm sure for some people it's S. For me, it's pretty cool. We get lost in the moment. You need a lot of substances to do so, though. For me. Dentists? C. I don't think they're too bad. I've never had a problem with them. I mean, it could just be my perfect teeth. But um, they're fine for me. I, I get why some people would hate them. It can be very painful. Hopefully, I don't have to have an extraction or anything scary. If I did, probably D. But for me, C. Deserts. I mean, it's in the name, isn't it? D. Not much going on. I mean, you can do sand dune... You know, the sand walk of Paul Atreides. Sandworms live out there, you know. There's some oases, uh, but otherwise it's pretty arid. You know, I live in a very deserted country. I've been to the desert many times in Australia. Again, the sand dune, uh, what's it called? Not sand, sand surfing. That's fun as fuck, but otherwise it's pretty bad. Doggies. I might go S tier for dogs. I fucking love dogs. I'm a dog person. I have a border collie. Oh. I've always had a dog my whole life. Blue healers, Labradors, uh, Golden Retrievers, border collie, German Shepherd, and then little moodle, poodley dogs. They're amazing. Man's best friend for a reason. Fuck you, cats. You're below. And I've had cats my whole life too, but dogs are superior. I'm sorry. There it is. Argument settled. I've just done it. Doors. I mean, they're great. You can go through them. They're it's like, you know, an aeroplane. It, it, it's a transit thing. Huh? Full stop. drive throughs are pretty good. Um, so this is Wendy's. For society as a whole, I actually think they're not great for us. Yeah, I, I can't go D because they're not terrible and they bring a lot and they're fast. But I can't get B because they're just so bad for it. It's like, it's like the TikTok of eating out. <laughs> you know, it's just not good for the brain and the neural pathways to instantly get things. Uh, instant gratification and all that and what have you. Elephants? Pretty sick. Uh, elephants are B tier, I think. I like them. They're cuties with the booties. Hey, yo, what the Elevators? Mm, C. Same thing. It's transport. It's transient. But they guess they're scary. I've been in ones that have dropped, locked me in there. Uh, no aircon. Scary stuff. I think there's got to be a better way, you know? Gotta be a better way. Fall or autumn. My birth season. I prefer autumn. Beautiful name for a girl as well. Uh, shout out my autumns out there. Fall is the season of change. Uh, again, my birthday is in there, so I'm biased. I love it. It's it's cool and not too hot, but not too cold. It's like that perfect in between. Whereas spring is like sneezy and hot and ugh. Ball is just that mwah, magnifique. That's an S. Fast food. I'm going to say the same reason as... Actually, I'm going to give it a D because it's so bad for us. It's delicious, but it's just not... If it didn't exist, we'd be better for it. You can agree with that. 
fingernails. Oh my god, on the back. They're pretty great. So the other F I N G R E R E R thing. Uh, you know. The Barracuda works really well. Unless you have long fingernails or dirty fingernails, and then you have to switch to the the scissor. Little, little. But the fingernails are pretty great. Remember, two in the pink, one in the stink. Uh, that's the motto to live by with that. Next, fire. Pretty bad. I mean, as a concept, let's go see because it's it's useful and it's super harmful probably equally. It's probably more harmful than good though, but technically electricity is fire. So that's pretty cool, but we're not doing electricity, we're doing fire. So let's see. Fire works. They're A. They're pretty great. Not good for the environment. Um, expensive. You know, can be overdone. And drones are sort of taking taking the stage there. But fireworks, I love them. I always did as a kid. You know, these magnificent explosions of love and, you know, bringing people together. The concepts. Again, the concepts seem very strong. And that's important to recognize food trucks meep, meep. i think the same reason is you know it's the same as drive throughs convenience but it helps out and supports you know local businesses so i can see why it is uh compelling and they're not terrible not amazing Let's see froggies frog dogs i think i'm not a super big fan of frogs some can be cute i mean they eat insects and stuff but nah they're very middling they are what they are ribbity rabbity you heard me, frogs. Okay, funny bone. I mean, I I like it. When you hit it, it hurts, but it's not the worst. I'd say C. It's fun to play with your nerves now and then, you know? It's not your heart getting ripped out to a million shreds. Garbage truck. Dude, A tier easily. They're not S because of the environmental impacts of what they're doing with the garbage, and we all have way too much garbage. But in terms of the logistics and the simplicity and the niceties of having a garbage truck, I think it's fantastic. Can you imagine driving a truckload or a car full of rubbish to the dump or the tip or wherever you keep it? Oh my god. Once a week? No, thank you. A tier for garbage trucks. Geese. B tier. Honk. Honk. <laughs> my geese out there, you'll know what that means. Uh, B tier. Glasses. I mean, I'm wearing them right now. I think they're very good. I think it's a technological advancement like braces. Where did I put braces? C. Yeah, see, glasses are way better. I mean, the look isn't amazing. I mean, what do you think? Do I look good? <laughs> glasses are A because of the technological leaps. It, it Most people without them who would otherwise be blind can see. That is amazing marvel. And I put contacts in the same uh, thing. I'd say anything that helps people see. Definitely A tier, maybe even S tier. I'd just say not A because it's like another thing. Whereas like LASIK, if it didn't have any, you know, downsides, which it does, I uh, would be S. Grandmothers, easy S tier. The beautiful, my, my nan, rest in peace, was, you know, my best friend for my whole life, really. Um, I loved her very much and she helped me through a lot and she taught me a lot. And I think they're probably the backbone of society. Most important um, family member, <laughs> arguably. Grandpa's got the stories, but Grandma has the love and the stories and the cooking. So, you know, can't beat. Sorry, Grandpa. <laughs> Gum? Eh. D tier. It's used too badly. I mean, I use it sometimes for, you know, my mewing routine, six hours a day. But gum itself, it, it sticks to stuff, you know. You put in girls' hair and they scream, cry at you and stab you in the heart um, like it's your fault or something. But yeah, I think it's nefariously used gum. I think that's the problem with it. So it's a D tier. Handshakes. And they can be pretty cringe. Pretty cringe, I'd say. 90% um, of the time it's like a posturing ego thing. Oh, but all handshakes? Maybe B. The ego bullshit pulls it down. But the cool handshakes you got with the broskies and the brother bears and the forest puppies, I mean, that makes it much better. So B. Hiccups. <laughs> oh, no, nah, I hate hiccups. They always suck and I can't get rid of them. Hate them. They're not good. They're cute and babies. That's why they're not E, but they suck. High fives. I mean, it's just a worse handshake. Hiking. Go on a hike! A tier. Climbing mountains. Seeing stuff. Amazing. Uh, 
can sometimes hurt your feet though, so that's why it's not S. Jellyfish, B. Look cool, can kill you, therefore not A or S. Jeans. Mm, B tier because it makes women's booties look good sometimes. Uh, don't actually like them on men. I think it's like pretty outdated and shit. But on women, can't. That goes for anything really. Juice boxes. I mean, B tier, pretty great. Not S because the environmental impact. They're just good for you. You know, good old fashioned juice. Jumping. C. I mean, it is what it is. It's not amazing. Jumping on a trampoline is pretty cool, but it just says jumping. Ketchup or tomato sauce. B tier. Kneecaps. My leg! Honestly, E tier. Not a fan of. I mean, they cause. They have too much damage and stuff. You know, and the cartilage and the problems. And I've had surgery on mine and just. Yeah. Not the worst thing in the world, but they suck. Lakes. A tier. They look amazing. You can swim in them. But not S because the dangers below the surface. Laptops. Portable computer. Pretty cool. Bad for the environment. All that jazz. But I have one. Always had one. They're helpful and useful, and you can take them places. Laws. Yeah, that's tough. A, because it, it took us from a society of primitive destruction into a somewhat, uh, you know, semblance of a working society. It'll never be perfect, but I think they were significantly important in crafting societies. Lightning. Looks pretty cool, but it can kill you, so it's B. Mailboxes. You've got mail. Mm, nah, I don't like them. It's always junk mail or terrible stuff. I hate that. Get out of here, you know. If it's important enough, you will carry a pinch in it to me. But it, mathematics, yeah, easily. <laughs> Obviously, super important. I don't personally love it, so it's not S, but it's super, super, super important for our progression as a species and our understanding of the universe uh, and the phys physics of it all. Middle school. Damn. I'm going to say this is, it's like what, grade six through to eight, something like that. We don't have it in Australia, but I can comment on those years. Yeah, they suck pretty hard. I was bullied relentlessly. It was rough. I learned a lot about myself, but in a terrible way, I had terrible home life. I'm sure a lot of kids, middle school is probably one of the worst times of their life, if I had to guess. I, I, I would imagine a lot of Fs. Speaking of Fs, we have no Fs. Isn't that interesting? Midnight <laughs> is, I mean, it is what it is. It's nothing crazy, but it looks cool if you can stay up to then. And it's like a brag. I would say C, actually. It's not even all that. Movie theaters. Cool concepts. Can be annoying with people talking, um, but it brings people together to watch a single thing and, you know, feel together, feel the emotions. I think they definitely need to spruce up, though. They're way too expensive. They don't offer really anything different than a big, you know, home theater experience anymore. And they're just way too overpriced and... You know, pretty disgusting, a lot of them as well. Pens. I mean, pens. C. I don't know. Pooping can feel pretty good. Not S or A because it can hurt sometimes. Leave you with those little bleedy magoos. Huh? But otherwise, a good poopy poop can uh, feel great. Printers. No. I mean, D because we need them for some things, but it destroys the environment. The ink is way overpriced. And never get the printer to work. The software sucks and they never update it on purpose to keep you always buying the next one. Yeah. The concept of printing, great. The execution, terrible. Cues. Oh. It, this might be our first F. I fucking hate cues. These are worse than crowds because it's like a crowd in a single line for something you need or want. It's important to keep you like grounded in reality and so you don't always get everything instantly, like we talked about the fast food. But yeah, cues, I hate them. They make me feel terrible. The longer it is, the worse I feel, obviously. Um, so it probably is an E, but I want to give an F. So fuck you, Qs. Rainforests. A. Love them. Not S because the ticks and the parasites and the leeches and the terrible stuff. But still amazing and I would live in one if I could. Rainbows. I mean, they're pretty cool. A because they don't... Probably B, actually, because they don't do much. Put it up here. They don't do much, but they are sick and they are a universal sign of, you know, peace and acceptance and unity and coolness. So rain for me is S tier. I love the rain. Maybe because I don't live in it every single day, but I I adore the rain. I run in the rain. I love the rain. I live the rain. Live, laugh, love, rain. Nearly there. 
Rivers, same as likes. Where did I put that? A, I think. Where are your likes? Yeah, B. A, A. Same as likes. Great. Swimming them, but there's nasty, nasty chop drops down beneath the thing. Roller coasters. B. Mostly overblown. The feeling you get that rush of adrenaline's great. Um, but you know, can't do it all the time. And uh it's expensive to get on them. Running. I personally don't like running. The endorphins are great, keeping it from, you know, D tier. But I'm good at it and I still don't like it, so what does that have to tell you? I'm sure I just pissed off a lot of runners out there. <laughs> Go do a marathon, you 30 year old. Uh sailing. Mm, I can see why people like it, but it's not for me. D. Segways. Segway. I mean, E, we don't need them. They hurt people. They you run into people, they're mostly used for nefarious things. They're just a worse scooter, you know? Siblings. Brother, ooh. Pretty great, you know, not perfect. Uh can a lot of disagreements, but you know, they'll always be there for you. So maybe even eh, B or A. It's like B plus A minus. I'm still gonna say B. I'm a terrible person. Singing? For me, S tier, I think it can change the way you see the world a good song. So very important. Skiing, never done it. Looks pretty cool. A lot of people get hurt though, but it's probably B. I had to guess. Snowboarding, I'm going to put in the same bucket. So I look forward to trying. Skin. A. Pimples and stuff like that that you can get on it. Oiliness. Blech. Dry skin, crack skin. But other skin in certain places. Hey, yo, what the f Um, remember our barracuda? Or scissors? Or two in the pink, one stink, etc. Fantastic for that reason. Um, and, you know, it's the largest organ of the body. Cool fact. Skyscrapers, F. <laughs> yep, I said it. You seen a theme with the capitalism bullshit? Skyscrapers, they're not needed. They're too high in the sky. They block views. They're dangerous. Uh, they planes can be flown into them. You know? Uh, yeah, I. It's too. It's too cramped. It's too much. It's just ugh. I think low. My answer would be medium rise, low and medium rise density housing. Um, nothing more than you know ten. 10 stories, I think, is the max. Uh, skyscrapers are like 50 plus, so fuck no. Sleeping? Pretty good. Me, 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 me. Pretty good. I'm gonna say A. I like it. Dreaming as well is amazing, but that's not there. Slice bread? Eh. It's alright. I don't care much for it. Sloths? Pine cones. They're very cute. B. Small talk? E. It's fake, it's bullshit, but it's not the worst thing in the world, and it's important if, you know, even actually D, we'll say D for the small talk. It's good to start somewhere, then never talk to anyone again. Um, so therefore, I think it's important, but big talk is obviously way better, you know, talking about stuff like this that you're watching right now. And speaking of watching right now, if you are enjoying this, uh, please make sure to like and comment your favorite part, and subscribe with notifications on. And uh, yeah, let me know how I'm doing. What What's your favorite part? And would you like to see more of this? Thanks so much. Okay, snacks, danger noodles, nope ropes. I'm gonna say E. Sorry, my little legless lizards. Um, you're too scaly, you know, you're scary looking. You attack animals like cats and dogs. I, you're just living your life, I get it. But yeah, we don't really need you. You know what I mean? We don't need you. So, yes, sorry, Snackins, but that is an E. Sneezing can feel good, but overall sucks. Snow, haven't felt it much, but I imagine it would be pretty cool, but it's very cold. So, B, socks. Crocs on the socks and the Crocs and socks. Socks, I mean, socks are socks, C. Style Eclipse is pretty cool. It's B, speed bump. D, I hate them, they damage your car, they're for the hooligans, not the normal person, they suck. Spicy food is pretty good, but... Spicy meatballs! No, yeah, it's pretty good, B. Spiders, yeah, D, sorry guys, some of you are alright, but you're better than snakes, but yeah, you're just... Some of you, especially in Australia, can kill me in uh, like 15 seconds or something crazy, so no thank you. Sponges, I don't care much for them, <laughs> C. Spoons a B, good to have cereal with. Spreadsheets, F, fucking hate them. Get rid of them. Data, ugh, yucky. Spring, I'd say spring is B, where autumn, fall is S. 
the stock market. F as well, even though I invest. I think it's one of the bullshit things we make up to basically saying, oh, that's worth something. Oh, that's worth something. It's all bullshit capitalist bleh. But necessary evil maybe suits. Where's my suit? I don't mind them, but they're pretty cringe for what they stand for and represent. Summer. Way too hot. E. I prefer the other seasons. Sunsets. S. Love it. I don't sweat too much, but I hate it. Sweaty. Swimming. A. Love the sport. Table tennis. B. And yeah, B. Tag. You're it. Actually, A. I like tag. It's fun. Posters. C. Toothpaste. C. Traffic lights. D. Freeze. S. Give us life and love and all that. Trophies. Mm. D. I don't know. What? Who cares? Umbrellas. Could have mentioned C. Video games. A. Volcanoes. B. Watermelon. C. Don't care from too much. Weddings. E. D. I get they're important for, you know, mostly women, but they're outdated. We don't need them. Winter. A. And yawning. Ooh. We're going to chuck that in B for our final tier list. Thank you so much for watching. This was the everything tier list. You can see my choices here. Make sure to comment below your favorite part. Do you agree with my points? Uh, would you change anything? What's your S tier? Let me know in the comments below. While you're down there, give this video a like and subscribe with the notifications on if you liked it. I've been Nate Luke. You've been Nate's mates. Thanks so much for watching and I'll catch you in the next one. Cheers.